Plainsman and Franco Tarek, the favourite. Mobile heading into the back. 2,550 before them. Green light goes on, arms go back and they're away. And Son of a Star began nicely. It's going up in search of the lead with Can't Explain It, who's trying to hold it out in the early part, but won't be able to do so. Pump and Iron and Sir Lafoe get to third and fourth early with Sir Lafoe trapped a little bit deep into that first turn. Then Sue West, Brighton, Sunny, Canandy Illusion. Next was Dean Aces. Lorad Mahag also trapped three wide. It's just being restrained back. Franco Tarek's got a couple behind, behind it in the early part. And they are the Plainsmen and I Will Defy. So into this straight they come on the first occasion and they've got 2,000 metres left to travel and on top now Pump and Iron. Mark Callaghan takes it to the lead over Son of a Star on the leader's back. Sir Lafoe trapped facing the breeze. It's in third position. Can't explain it. Three back the inside. Then Bright and Sunny. Sue West is four back pegs. Covered up by Dean Aces. Canandy Illusion on the inside of Franco Tarika will defy. Then came the Plainsman and Lorad Mahag on the pegs is at the tail. Out of the straight they run. And heading towards the back. And it's Pump and Iron on top and striding out stylishly. As they head towards the mile marker, it's Pump and Iron leading clearly over Son of a Star who's on the leader's back. And third on the outside is Sir Lafoe. That lead time in 1 minute 11.0. Then came Franco Tariq, who's making a mid-race move, so the favourite's going up to sit outside this leader. That means can't explain it, three back on the inside. Next then was Brighton Sunny, who's in the running line. Sue West, followed uh, further back by Dean Aces. It's on the outside of Canandy Illusion. Uh, I Will Defy was next, followed by the Plainsman, and back at the rear is Lorad Mahag. Up towards the home bend, they've got 1,200 metres left to travel and that first quarter was 30.2 and it's Pump and Iron who's led pretty much through out. It's Pump and Iron leading uh, by four metres over the favourite Franco Tariq who sits outside the leader now. And then came Son of a Star, third the inside. Sir Lafo was next. Can't explain it. On the inside, Sue West, Bright and Sunny, Dean Aces, Canandy Illusion, the Plainsman. And then came further back, I Will Defy, and last is Lorad Mahag. Out of the straight they run. They're at the 900 metre point or just inside it now. And it's still Pump and Iron. There's really been no changes in this race apart from the favourite Franco Tarek going up uh, mid-race and sitting outside the leader and he still sits up second Son of a Star was next followed by Sir Lafoe, Dean Aces taking off three wide and then Can't Explain It Bright and Sunny, next was Sue West further back came uh, the Plainsman who's on the outside there of Canandy Illusion and further back to Lorad Mahag second last and I will defy now back to the rear, a pretty pedestrian second quarter as they ran down the back straight 32.5 and they now pass the 427.7 so the pace went on, Pump and Iron leads over Franco Tarek, Son of a star in third spot. They've got away from Can't Explain It. Sir Lafoe, Dean Aces, the Plainsman coming to the outside. And then came Brighton, Sunny and Sue West into the straight at the 180. It's Pump and Iron being tackled by Franco Tarek. Pump and Iron a metre in front of Franco Tarek then Son of a Star. Pump and Iron in front's got a kick. Franco Tarek diving at it late. Pump and Iron holding on from Franco Tarek. Pump and Iron just over Franco Tarek. Maybe Sue West got up for third ahead of Son of a Star. The Plainsman was close up. Then came Bright and Sunny. Canandy Illusion can't explain it. Sir Lafoe, I will defy Dean Aces. And Lared Mahag at the tail throughout. 